Greenoid, Elish Griffin, and I made this game for Ludum Dairy 49. It was called Fellowship Manager 1021, which was uh, a kind of uh, tribute to the championship manager games or the football manager games, which are based on football sims, where you kind of just manage a bunch of players. You don't actually play football. You just click a bunch of things and make decisions, and then there's a simulated football match. And so we did that, but based more in like medieval times where you, you were managing a fellowship or an army of people. So let's check it out, shall we? So the idea in this game then was that you create a fellowship. Uh, we can give the fellowship a name. Uh-oh, I'm worried. Is it laggy? Yeah, there's definitely lag. Mm. Why is it going so bad? <laughs> Our poor Unreal games. Alright, let's try this. Let's try this. See if it goes any better now. Yeah, that it's that's better. That's many. Uh, that's better, sorry. Okay, so, you choose your fellowship name. So we will be... Uh, the special effect. All right, and we choose our little icon. You can see these are tributes to some of the games uh, that we've uh, played previously uh, from our back catalogue, so we can be Greedy Dog Steve if we want. And then the idea of the game is that you... Uh, this is the map, this is the world, and uh, your objective is to go around the world, gather an army, Gain enough reputation so that you can go and defeat the king who has gotten mad with power. So, uh, you can move to any of these tiles around your character. Uh, so if we move over here, we arrive at a village. A bustling visit, uh, village housing the kingdom's inhabitants and perhaps some recruits. So here you're able to rest to recover, eat, drink, heal, pray, or attempt to recruit new followers. So we can spend a day here. Yeah, Brainoid made this music is great. Really good. So the idea then is you have all these different characters and these different characters have different stats. They have combat stats. And they have general out of combat stats as well. And you can choose for them to do different things when you spend the night on different tiles. So based on their stats, you may want them to do different things. Uh, food, they're all pretty hungry. I mean, so we could all eat a little bit. Have we got much food? We've got 20 food, it says at the top right. So we're probably going to eat to begin with. Let's get them eating. Uh, have we got someone who's high on charisma, actually? They could recruit for us. So we're going to get uh, this Grog the Drunkard to recruit for us. All right, let's go. So we ate seven bits of food. We got one more fellow from the recruitment. But we lost some uh, reputation because we weren't fighting. And we're trying to build up this rest reputation with the king and his armies that we are a fellowship to be feared. So let us go and fight. So the fighting was great. Bro Knight worked hard on making a little uh, simulator, like in football uh, simulator games, where you have two teams who are going to uh, face off against each other and we can set the tactics. So uh, let's try and do that, shall we? So you can arrange in different kind of patterns. And then for each group, you can give them different tactics as well. So we can make these charge on the right. We can make these move forward slowly. And then we could make these if we want, like flank left to go to the either side with the other team. And then the numbers correspond to what battle blocks the characters are in. So if you want, you could <clears throat> give the frontliners the one with the most health, put the health, make those in the front. So B1 and B6 should be our biggest health boys. So B6, B1, that's working out all right so far. B1, B1. Uh, you can get out of B6. And you can go to B6 instead. And you can change what weapons they are, but they, they will automatically quit their best selected weapon. All righty. So we then start our battle. And it automates it. And it gives football style commentary at the bottom. Boris taunts. Oh, we can put it slower. So here we have. Bora is running towards Joe. He draws his bow. Bora got hit by Joe's arrow. Oh, it's over. We won. It doesn't matter. <laughs> so one unit got one of his attributes leveled up. All right. That's pretty cool. So we got a reputation. That's good. 
but what we need to keep an eye on, which isn't very obvious, is your stats. So we have energy, we have food, we have water. We're not too bad at the moment. But as we move about, that will go down. So we will just keep on moving for now. We'll go to another fight. I think we're doing okay. How's our health? Health is fine as well. Let's go. So we can get the combat speed going up this time. But the commentary is great. It actually does follow what's actually happening on the field as well. The special effect for, well, three units got some of their levels. Uh, a tri a tributes leveled up. Awesome. Let's keep exploring this map. And basically, based on the tile you're in, you have different options. So we have rest, heal, eat, or cook here, for example. But if I was to go to the forest tile, you can rest, eat, cook, or hunt. So we could hunt for some food. It might be a good idea to hunt because we don't have that much food. So the ones that are good at hunting, we will send to hunt. Let's do that. And then everyone else, I mean, you need to eat by the looks of it. Uh, OS the frog. Anyone else particularly hungry? Yeah, Grog, you need to eat. And then the rest of you can, I think you can just rest in order to recover some energy. So you'll rest. It's proper stat management sort of game. <laughs> okay, so let's go. Let's perform. So there you go, three fellows rested, two food supplies were eaten, 16 animals were hunted. There we go, we got loads of food. That'll help us. Let's go to the town. And we're gonna try and recruit some new fellows. So uh, let's use our high charisma folk to recruit. You are great, let's go, recruit, recruit. But the more people you have, you gotta remember, you gotta feed them all, you've gotta manage them all. So it's a bit of a curse having too many people. As for everyone else, I think our, we could probably do a, a drinking. So let's go ahead and drink. A lot of people, you can only drink on certain tiles, like towns and rivers. Uh, so, yeah, that sounds a good idea. Let's do that. Five people drank, three new followers were recruited. Alrighty. Let's keep killing. Uh, the best I can do in 72 hours is music. Honestly, I've had the most enjoyment in a jam sometimes where I just do, like, assets, you know, rather than the games. I think, like, coding games can be w one of the most stressful parts. I don't think other people have it easy, don't get me wrong. It's just if the code isn't ready, everything falls apart. Whereas if the art and that isn't ready, then things, because you've still got a game loop and people can appreciate, oh, they just ran out of time in that a bit. Uh, wh where are you based? Esku. Sorry to hear about that. That sounds pretty tough. Okay, so, uh, where do we want to go? Let's go and fight more people on the way to the king. Uh, what's our stats like? Do we need to recover? Yeah, okay. Let's, uh, let's spend the day and let's let people recover, shall we? I think everyone's energy is low, so let's spend the night. Okay, now let's fight. So maybe we can change our, our position somewhat. Let's go for the... Uh, um, oh, look at some of the faces Elisha made as well. So we had like a randomly generated face uh, for the people based on the, a bunch of different uh, attributes that it would um, combine. They were great. <laughs> look at their faces. <laughs> Yeah, really nicely done. In Kentucky, is it? Crikey, sorry to hear, Esku. That sounds difficult. Okay, so uh, let's go for a fake... <laughs> a fake retreat for those? Maybe not. So you can strategize with it, but realistically, they, they do something for the first start of the fight, and then they'll just find someone and battle and fight them and hit them and all shoot arrows at them. So one thing we could do is like get those bow people in the back line. So if we go for maybe a, a let's go for a compact and B5 and B6, we're going to have our bowers in. So let's go and do that. So B5, 
Or B6, that's fine. Any other bows? Yeah. You can go in B5. Any other bows? You can go in B6. And then all the others who are in B5 and B6 need to be changed to something different. Oh, he was bow. There we go. Okay, so we have a couple in this back line who'll be shooting their bows. Okay, let's... Uh, oh, uh, I don't know what, whether I agree with the strats that we've got going here. But why not? Why not? Let's go for this. <laughs> the classic. Um, these these can just go straight, actually. There we go. Just a, a <laughs> these just kind of need to hold as well. I think they move forward slowly. will probably be fine on those. Okay, let's go. There you go. Our, our archers at the back, and then everyone else having a fight. Ah, oh, beautiful tanking going on there. No one's near the archers. Excellent. All right, off we go. Let's carry on. Uh, how's our stats? We could all do with a... Uh, not quite a, a recovery yet, but food. We're all hungry, actually. It might be time to eat. So, th let's go ahead and do that. It would have been nice if we had a set everyone to eat button, but... Hey, we didn't. Alright, everyone getting a chance to eat anyway. We got, had a good hunt the other night. Oh, hang on. Okay, it's remembered it, thankfully. Okay, perform the night. There we go. We ate. So, if we... We can go to the temple if any of our people are unstable. But at the moment, they're quite low on instability. That, that increases as you fight more. So, let's go ahead and fight. Let's go. Again, archers in the back row again. I think we got a good strat here. Success. Some of our characters got leveled up. Okay, so we could go and have a drink, maybe on the on the. Uh, oh, we could wash as well. Our hygiene is going down at the moment. Some of us are more stinky than the others, though. So let's bathe. Some of the people who are quite low on uh, their hygiene. We can fish as well. These boys are okay. They're relatively new. Uh, they can instead maybe focus on fishing for us. Go fishing. All right, off we go. Here we go. Eight fellows bathed and became less filthy. All right, next up, we need to keep building up our reputation. So we're going to fight these. I'm happy with my strats now, although they are getting more and more units. So maybe we do need to do a bit of a recruitment. Have we lost anyone? Okay, we need to check our health, actually, before we get into the next fight. Um, let's spend the day. How's our health? Like, look at this. This guy's really low. So, who's good at healing? Healing. You can be a medic. You can be a medic. You can be a medic, and you can be a medic. you got to help everyone recover their health. Okay, other than that... What are our stats are? The food is quite low. Oh, energy. You're going to die if you don't rest. Crikey. Same here. You need to rest. Some people are very low on energy. Alright, you're going to have to rest. We'll get the next best medic instead. Alright, let's try that. Okay, time to fight. How's the energy levels? Anyone going to die after this? No, I think we're okay. We're okay. Let's fight. Oh, amazing kill. All right. All right. We're doing all right. Let's go here. We're going to try and recover a bit here. So we can rest. I think we'll rest everyone. Uh, the food is quite low as well, as is our water. All right, first we'll just rest. Then we'll go here. 
I think we need to drink as well some of these. Look at the stats. It's quite hard to manage them. But we could just recruit new people and not worry about the ones who are going to die. <laughs> but no, we'll try and keep the band together. All right, so they're drinking. What do these people need? You probably need to eat. Yeah, we can get eating done for these folks. Uh, yeah, let's eat some more. And you can eat two. War, ah. All right. We should have probably recruit as well, but all right, let's keep going. Time to fight. Got to keep an eye on our health as well as we go forward. All right, who do we need? Some people are maybe close to death. Energy is fine. Food is fine. I mean, well, you ease a little low. You can have a bit of food. Water is going to be all right for now. Hygiene, anyone stinky? No. All right, in which case then, I think everyone else can rest. We'll probably get a medic or so to help with the odd bit. You can do some medicking as well. Your, your stats are all right. You still need to eat. You can just rest. Actually, no, you can help be a medic too. You need to... Uh, you need to eat. The rest of you have eaten quite a bit, though, so I think... Uh, we'll call it there. That's fine. Okay, let's go fight. We're on our way to take the king down. As long as we can survive these next two battles. We should be fine. All righty. We'll take on these next ones, and I will check our stats before taking on the king. So you need a certain amount of reputation to take on the king. I don't know if we've got enough. We've got 630 at the moment. We haven't lost any soldiers either, which is quite an achievement. Let's have a look at our stats before we go any further. Energy's fine. Health is medium. No, health is good. Alright, can we take on the king? We can. I think it's time. Good luck, men. It's the king's, the mad king's army. We may be outnumbered, but we have practiced. We've leveled up. We formed an alliance, the special effect, to take down the mad king and bring stability back to the lands again. Victory is ours. And we didn't really have time for an ending. So instead you have this. But it's fine, right? So what I'm confused about right now is like my stream is lagging majorly. Like my camera is miles behind like what I'm doing. And we've just got a widget on the screen. I really need to work on like how we optimize our games in Unreal because it's terrible. Like, it runs super smooth on my computer, don't worry about that. It's just more of like when streaming it. We need to think about that. I rate this manager C just like the pizza, right? <laughs> it's the same sort of run out of time ending. 